ranks right up there. Now you're doing what you thought was best for Michael. Tough love, right? I don't know, maybe this will scare him straight. Michael will get out of his head that he doesn't want to be in the mob. Mm -hmm. I mean, one night in lockup's not going to kill him. A little bit of food might. <laughs> you should get him a bacon cheeseburger from Kelly's. That's his favorite. You know what? I haven't eaten a thing all day. <gasps> Me neither. I should order a pizza out of mushrooms and sausage sound. Mm, you know what? I got a better idea. Okay, no. Hang on. Just give me a minute. <clears throat> okay, don't open your eyes. Just, just smell. <laughs> it's the cheese? It's not just any cheese. It's Parmigiano Reggiano. My wow. mother always said, if you want to make a good meal, you start out with a good hunk of cheese. That's a good hunk of cheese. Yeah, you're telling me. What are we making? Pasta Peramonte. It's a uh, loose translation is pasta for lovers. I mean, I know, I know we haven't quite gotten there yet. But... Well, not for lack of trying. I mean, I know that cooking is in your blood. It's just not in mine. We can chop a couple tomatoes, can't you? Maybe. I'll teach you. Um, I think that we'll both be in over our heads. You and I, uh, I don't I think we can do anything. <laughs> including making pasta. Pasta per more. Month. Per month. Yes, he said yeah. it's half a bit. <laughs> Come on, what do I got to do to try and get you to do this with me? I'll think of something. Mm -hmm. What? You say dice to someone in my family when we think of crafts. Small cubes, like dice. <laughs> whoa, whoa, stop. No, no, way. I'm dicing. Just no, 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 no. you are dice. mangling. No, I'm not. <laughs> first, first, hang on, wait. I'll show you. <laughs> think of the knife as an extension of your arm, okay? You just let the blade do the work, right? Wow. Mom teach you this? Actually, no, there was a, a snowstorm when I was a kid. I was stuck in the house for days. I was bored out of my mind, so I actually asked my mother if I could help her cook dinner one time. She told me to chop the onions. <clears throat> and uh, she saw the hack job I did and basically burst into tears and banished me from her kitchen. So you saw that as a challenge? Sort of watching those cooking shows on the down low, practice, and show <laughs> what I could do. And that's when you started cooking? Actually, I never chopped another onion in my life. I made my point. Which was... Don't tell me I can't do something I want to do. Case in point, it wasn't that long ago. You told me I didn't have a chance with you. And now here we are, dicing. We're doing good. So you're just going to stand there and watch me? No, I'm going to work on the uh, secret recipe. What is it? Is this something from your mom? No, it's actually my uncles who got it from their grandfather, who got it from his grandfather, who brought it with them over on the boat. Uh, you know, the women of the family don't think the falconary men know how to do anything in the kitchen, but we can hold our own. <gasps> oh, so it's from the jar! Okay, you can't tell anyone, all right? But I, I am good at opening cans, too. <laughs> wow, well, that's good, considering all the people in this town that want to poison us. Well, we'll just hole up in here. We won't go anywhere. That's a little, uh, oh, dramatic. Oh. But we can, uh, grow our own food. We live in a loft. Rooftop garden. In the wintertime, you can ice fish in Castle Line oh. off the, uh, the fire escape. It's not that far to the harbor. Yeah, you just need a mile-long pole. What are we gonna do about clothes? I don't think we need clothes. I mean, I'm gonna have to break up these windows anyway in case Jason decides to take a shot at me. Oh. Hey, hey, yeah, you okay? What you said about Jason, I mean, that could happen. Are you kidding me? You think anyone's going to come after me knowing they got to get through you first? <laughs> I'm going to panic. Stopped. Better? Thank you. Okay, you just sit there. I'm going to take care of you. I made a tough decision today. It wasn't an easy decision for me to make by taking Michael in. I know you had your opinions about it, but you just listened and let me figure it out on my own. To you for sticking by me through thick and thin and grated cheese. 
to you, to your courage. I know you wanted to put Sonny in prison, but in the end, you did the right thing. Well, how about to us and all good things to come? It's all good things. Not bad for sauce from a jar. <laughs> the tomatoes were fresh and well diced. What's the matter? Oh no, I'm. Uh, I was just thinking about Carly and how she unloaded on me. Oh yeah, we both got a hefty dose of Carly. You probably got the worst of it though. Carly's angry, and part of me actually feels like I shouldn't fight back. That I should just take it, you know, because. Right or wrong, I helped put her son in jail. Well, being by my side isn't going to be the most comfortable place. But there's no other place I would rather be. Well, I wasn't going to let you get away anyway, now that you've seen my cooking secrets in the kitchen. Uh, could you do something for me? Help me with the dishes? Better than pizza? Mmm, yes. I have learned to properly dice tomatoes. I made it out of the kitchen with nine fingers. I like playing house with you. And I'm privy to a scandalous falconary secret, which I can use to get you to do whatever I want. I know, now you have me at your mercy. Your mom was right. Hmm? About the cheese? Mm. Well, I'll take you shopping. I know all the best cheeseries. Oh, I know. That's where you get your pickup lines. I can't argue with success. Yes. But then I would have to cook. I'll bring the wine and the bandages. Well, it's late. And it's not, I... it's not that late. Sorry, I, I, what were you going to say? Uh, well, I just... <laughs> Maxie... You know, I was out of town, so I have to work, so. So. Okay. <sighs> well, I, I mean, you can you come over one night, and uh, we'll do dinner. I'll teach you how to microwave. We'll <laughs> do fondue. That's cheese, right? You melt it in the pot. It's very safe. Yeah, there's no knives. Just pointy forks. Yeah. Yeah, you could stay. I love you, Lulu, and... I was really hoping you'd stay the night with me. I thought you would never ask. <laughs>